Measles or rubella is a highly contagious, serious airborne disease caused by a virus that can lead to severe complications and death. Measles is caused by a virus in the paramyxovirus family. The virus infects the respiratory tract, then spreads throughout the body, causing severe complications. Signs and symptoms of measles include fever, dry cough and runny nose, and sore throat, inflamed eyes or conjunctivitis, tiny white spots with bluish white centers on a red background found inside the mouth on the inner lining of the cheek also called coplic spots, a skin rash made up of large, flat blotches that often flow into one another. Measles is caused by a virus found in the nose and throat of an infected child or adult. When someone with measles coughs, sneezes, or talks, infectious droplets spray into the air, where other people can breathe them in. Complications of measles may include Diarrhea and vomiting Diarrhea and vomiting can result in losing too much water from the body or dehydration. Ear infection One of the most common complications of measles is a bacterial ear infection. Bronchitis, laryngitis, or croup Measles may lead to irritation and swelling of the airways. It can also lead to inflammation of the inner walls that line the main air passageways of the lungs or bronchitis, and inflammation of the voice box or laryngitis. Pneumonia. Measles can commonly cause an infection in the lungs or pneumonia. People with weakened immune systems can develop an especially dangerous type of pneumonia that sometimes can lead to death. Encephalitis. The condition can be especially dangerous for people with weakened immune systems. Encephalitis may occur right after measles, or it might not occur until months later. Encephalitis can cause permanent brain damage. Pregnancy problems. If you're pregnant, you need to take special care to avoid measles because the disease can cause premature birth, low birth weight, and fetal death. The measles vaccine is usually given as a combined measles mumps rubella vaccines or called MMR vaccine. Treatment includes providing comfort measures to relieve symptoms, such as rest and treating or preventing complications. Immune serum globulin, pregnant women, infants and people with weakened immune systems who are exposed to the virus may receive an injection of immune serum globulin. Post-exposure vaccination, people without immunity to measles, including infants, may be given the measles vaccine within 72 hours of exposure to the measles virus to provide protection against it. Antibiotics, if a bacterial infection, such as pneumonia or an ear infection, develops while you or your child has measles, your healthcare provider may prescribe an antibiotic you can use over-the-counter medications such as acetaminophen, for fever. Vitamin A, giving a child vitamin A may lessen the severity of measles infection. And drink plenty of fluids, drink plenty of water, fruit juice and herbal tea will replace fluids lost due to fever and sweating. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Goodbye.